I'm an addict for sneak addict for sneak addict for What's good? It's your boy DJ Dells back with a brand new episode here at the Sneak Erratic Show, taking a look at the brand new retro of the Atonic Akeem Olajuwon shoe right here, the Dream. Akeem the Dream. Akeem Olajuwon first entered the NBA. He was the number one draft pick, 1984, Houston Rockets. And to this day, he makes a huge impact in the NBA. He's usually in training camps, helping some of your favorite NBA players like LeBron James, Dwight Howard, and many more. He is definitely a huge, huge inspiration for many. Let's take a look at him. Oh. Woo. So happy to have these. I'm just looking at him with you. First glance. Leather is nice, real nice leather. Definitely a nice full grain leather in white. And then as you can see, there's layers here. You've got a red full grain leather with the tonic going across in white. Then you have another layer of some yellow trim right there. You got these straps that weave in and out over here as you can see. These straps right here connect to this lace harness right there with some more red full grain leather. Taking a look at the midsole close up. Here's a look at the toe box. As you can see, you got some perforations. Going up top, you've got a leather tongue. A little bit of stitching over here. Red laces. A little bit of perforations on the tongue. Got your tag on the side. Got the artwork you've seen on the box. And there's a look at the label up top. Inside of the shoe is leather and red. There's a look at the footbed with some branding. There's a look at the medial side. Quick look at the back. There's a look at the outsole. And there you go with a close-up detailed look at these shoes. I know you want to see what these look like on feet. So let's get into that. Let's go. All right, so here we go with a look on foot. As far as the fit, I would say go true to size, maybe even go down half a size. I would have preferred to go down half a size on these. My toe got a lot of room over here. So I think they may run a little big. If you have wide feet though, you may want to stay true to size. You may not want to go down half a size. I don't recommend going up half a size on these though. Definitely, definitely, um, if I could go back in time, I would definitely get an eight and a half of these, not a nine. Besides that, these things look sick on feet. <laughs> Ridiculous. Don't you agree? Do you agree? Leave your comments in the box. And also make sure to hit that like button right now. I'm pretty sure this is the first actual review on these shoes on YouTube. So hit the like button if you love the show and if you enjoy all the episodes I give you on basically a weekly basis for over four years here at youtube.com forward slash the sneaker addict. And make sure to tell your friends to check out the show, to sub if they love shoes. Share this on your Facebook, Twitter, let your friends know about the show. And if you want more information on these shoes, go to the blog, thesneakerratic.com. That's my blog, it's an extension to this show to help you, you, and you out. Shout out to Tonic, shout out to Akeem Olajuwon. Really loving these right here. Make sure to follow my social networks, I'll put links in the description box below. And you already know I gotta hit you with that infamous burp, 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 birds off you. DJ Dell, you know I love you, love you, love you. Hey, this just man that winning his pledge. More status, y'all just follow commands.